guys, welcome to FK Studios and today we are going to be going on a tour of a very lovely farm which a dear friend of ours has let us make a video of. So as you can see on the right hand side when you start walking in through the entrance, there are very nice statues and garden gnomes and some very nice plants. And on your right hand side you can see some animals. Now, as we go further, on your right hand side you can see there is a duck pond and there are a few ducks which are walking around it and the pond looks really nice and up ahead there is a very nice looking farmhouse which is a bungalow. So as you can see the ducks are looking at me to see who I am and they're just walking around all day and they're free to do whatever they want the whole day and now as you can see there are more statues on the right hand side gravel Woo! so as we get further on your right hand side you could see an old well and you can see the ducks back there and I really like the pond so there is a small fence which you can see which is there to prevent the animals from escaping but most of the animals do not want to escape as they are perfectly happy staying in that farm because they can do whatever they want As we go further you can see an alpaca, it's not a llama, who is walking towards us and he just wants to have a sniff to recognize me. So now when I stick out my hand he's gonna give it a little sniff. He keeps following me because he doesn't know me. And alpacas are very common in Ireland. So now if you turn around you can see there is a path between the gates and the fence. And on your left right hand side you can see there are some chickens and some ducks and different kinds of birds. And there's a massive hen house. But some people also mistake as a playhouse but in fact is a hen house and as you can see there are roosters, ducks, hens and many different kinds of birds from all over the world. And now as we go further you could see that the ducks are just walking around and the chickens as well. And you can see that the younger ones are still inside the hen house. And now in front of me you can see there's a barbecue which is lovely on a nice summer day with a table and chairs to make your guests at home. And now as you can see there is a very nice pond which has a lot of goldfish in it which are very nice to look at. And this pond actually has some lights which you can see at night but unfortunately we weren't there for the night. And as you can see there are some very nice dolphin statues and there are two fountains as well in the water and also if you haven't please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel if you are new and as you can see this time the ducks are at our left hand and up ahead there is a very nice swing which is very soft and comfy where you could just lounge about and a very nice swing chair and behind the swing chair you could see the old well which I mentioned before which is currently covered so no ducks or any other animals fall inside so now we have the sheep family which are known as mommy daddy and the child and they're just walking around doing whatever they want so our dear friend told us that all the animals at the 
farm. They do whatever they want and they are free to roam around. Alpaca is still watching me from there. So now on the other side of the small fence you can see that there is also a an area which is for the roosters only because the roosters and the other birds they don't get along very well so they have been rehomed and the other side in a little area which has been fenced off back towards the alpacas and as you can see there's a few chairs where you can sit down and eat your barbecue on hot summer days so as you can see in the background there is a peacock And the peacock has just flown to the roof as you can see and there we go the alpaca wants another sniff so I stick out my hand and as you can see he's sniffing my hand and the peacock is currently climbing to the top of the roof as you can see and he, a peacock is a very exotic bird and unfortunately I wasn't able to catch the peacock when he had spread his wings because as you know when peacocks fully spread their wings they look very beautiful and the other two llamas are also roaming around and in the corner you can see there's just a small wooden playhouse which is also very nice to hang around in and here we have some storage sheds which include the food for animals and some nice statues which are in front of the wooden house and as you can see there is a tennis court behind everything and the alpaca is back again now you can see that the white alpaca and the brown one are too shy so they won't come over to sniff me and they are staring at me too scared to come over so now as you can see I have walked towards the tennis courts and there are two and the tennis court looks very nice and it is very fun to play with and there's a feather down there Woo. so now as you can see there's another wood house at the back and there is a white peacock which are in fact rare and there's another one as you can see and they can be hard to find and the alpaca is back at it again and as you can see there are some birds behind the tennis court so if I zoom in you'll be able to see that they aren't just any birds but they are in fact ostriches and it is said that the egg of an ostrich is very hard to break and you would probably need a hammer to break and even then it would be difficult which is a fun fact and we have a few trees around the place for a better environment I was told by the owner of this farm that the alpaca 
is actually trained so when you stick out your hand and you call it to come towards you it actually does but for some reason it did not come towards me probably because I was a stranger however when I went into the farm at first uh, the alpaca I didn't know who's behind me he started sniffing my neck and he gave me quite a fright but then when I saw what he was doing I was okay with it and the white peacock is there at the back So as you can see this time I'm going to go into the chicken enclosure and as you can see there are already a few birds near me and there are some chicks as well. As you can see, there are a few feeding trays on the ground, which include some food and some water as well. And as you can see, here is the hen house. And if you peer inside, you can probably see a few birds hiding somewhere. And inside the rooster enclosure, there are some wooden walkways, which are there by the trees and they are hanging off the trees and a few of the roosters are walking on them and inside you can see some chicks and some chickens so now as you can see there is a blue peacock and he looks very beautiful and peacocks are a tiny bit rare in Ireland but they can be easy to find if you look hard enough so anyways guys i would really like to thank you if you're still watching the video and if you're new to the channel please go down there and subscribe to the channel and please don't forget to hit the like button so now i think i'm gonna end the video with a clip of the peacock on the roof of one of the sheds so as i said before hit the like button and subscribe to my channel if you're new thank you very much for watching